Hey you guys, it's Sunshine Vibes with the High Vibrations. If you are new to my channel, thank you for watching. If you are returning, thank you for subscribing to your girl. Love and light to you all. I hope everybody is doing good on this Friday, okay? Okay, so I'm going to tap right into these messages and see what I have for you all today. So this card was already just sitting. I usually do these at the end, but okay, this is a Soul Truths card. And it says, what risk can I take today? Be not mistaken, you will have to take bigger risks than you ever thought possible on this path towards your dreams. You will have to take the big scary leap, but do not freak because your soul has wings. What risk can you take to move towards your dreams? Make a decision to do it. No more thinking, only doing. Be brave and courageous and you will discover what you really are made of. So you guys are giving me the energy of taking a leap of faith on yourself, right? You're being called to you know get out of your comfort zone okay i can definitely resonate with this okay so you've been trying to get out of your comfort zone okay and to explore because there's something about your calling it's very very big right it's really bigger than you okay so we're gonna tap in and see what else i have for you all give me one more that's too many cards me one card. It's been so hard for me to uh record these messages for some reason. Somebody doesn't want whatever this is to get out. Yeah, because you are healing abandonment issues here. It is time to forgive. So you guys are letting something go here. Okay. You're letting something go. You're receiving some type of cosmic intelligence when it comes to your creativity, the things you need to let go of your life that are not, that are hindering your growth, right? Something was hindering your growth. Yeah. Beyond illusion. Change your perception. You're being called to look at something beyond the illusion, right? So you're being called to look at something in a different perspective. Look at something way bigger than your norm. So you're able to actually fulfill this prophecy. Two, 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 as I say this. Um, so you guys are healing some abandonment issues. Or somebody feels abandoned, abandoned in your energy. Okay, maybe you are releasing someone. Imagination. I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. Somebody doesn't like the way you... Somebody doesn't like the way that you are focused on your mental. So some of you all could be like focused on your mental health. Mental health is important. It's very important, okay? We have so many clear and core rooms. So yeah, you guys are literally uh, running away from a soulmate. Um, this could be somebody that hurt you in the past, somebody that, you know, you had a strong connection with, but I feel like you finally built up the strength to change something. Somebody is definitely grieving in your energy. They are very lonely and they are worried that they are under judgment. We have King, the masculine and 7777 is here. So somebody was warned to leave you alone. I've been picking up on this energy. Yeah, because you changed and you was actually a gift to somebody. So somebody did not treat you the way you came to somebody's life to help them grow, right? Somebody's not learning a lesson. So you had to abandon this person and leave this person out in the cold. I feel like this person is realizing that, you know, you have a strong mind. You have a strong mindset. And it's okay for you to clear these wounds that this person has. This person is like, you know, like when you have a wound and somebody wants to like if somebody throws salt on it, it's gonna burn or put alcohol on it this is this is what this person wanted this person wanted something to hurt even more yeah failure but i feel like this person failed at this person failed maybe you abandoned this person before this person could even do this yeah you let go of some type of expectation you welcomed yourself home you're in your purpose so yeah there's yeah, this person, whoever this person is that's in your energy that you are abandoning, you do not want to reconcile with this person, okay? And this person is grieving about this. Somebody thought that you would never let them go. But I feel like now they see that mentally, you know, you can handle you can handle this. I can't make this up. Beyond illusion. Mentally, they feel like you can handle this because you changed your perception here. This person 
was not thankful to have you in their life either. Okay, this person didn't want something to end. Okay, this person wanted you to be working out of fear. This person's not growing and they're not happy. Okay, you realize that you had to welcome yourself home. So there's something going on with your crown chakra, right? I can't make this up. Thank you, Spirit. Crown chakra and third eye chakra. So you guys are very woke, right? You are seeing beyond the illusions. You are lifting the veil to something when it comes to relationships. Okay, people that no longer serve your highest good. Okay. So you're changing this perception. You're seeing beyond this illusion. You you understand you're not a failure. You know somebody is just in your energy and they feel abandoned because you are not giving them the energy that they want. Somebody wants your forgiveness. Yeah, because they see that you're at peace. This is definitely somebody you had a relationship with a relationship a relationship with that wanted you to feel guilty because you changed. And you're very patient for something. So you're waiting on something. Yeah, you're releasing some type of karmic relationship. This person does not want you to shift or be shifted. Because you are feminine energy. I could be talking to a divine femme, a divine masculine, okay? But you're activating your higher self. This doesn't necessarily mean you have to be a divine masculine or divine femme. Whoever you are, you are just woke, empathy i'm open to seeing both sides of the situation and this person doesn't like that okay somebody wanted you to wow, that card just came out of nowhere i admit that i was only a bitch because i envied you so yeah there is somebody else that's in this that's coming out in this energy that uh could have treated you a certain way because they envied you okay but there is something about your empathy the way you feel for others and taking responsibility here. So you're taking some type of responsibility when it comes to karmic relationships and releasing this past. Okay, Spirit wants you to let your light shine, you know. Some of y'all could be feeling like kind of sad because you got to change, okay, or because you change. Some of you, yeah, y'all like, you know, you are ready to release this person, but this person isn't ready to release you with death in reverse. This person wants something to continue on. Like somebody wants to run a marathon here. Yeah, reprogram your soul. Release, raise, and reclaim. So you're being called to reclaim and release this energy so you can call back your power. So merge. So you can so things can start back flowing. So if things have not been flowing, it's because of this person and your energy here. Because this person needs to learn to nurture their inner child and open up their heart. But I feel like this person rejected this when it comes to your healing. So you could have just been healing yourself, doing things, you know, to help yourself grow. And this person just wanted to come in and just fuck that up. Okay. They wanted to stop it. Like I said, they wanted something to, they wanted to put something over the wounds that hurt even more. But you end up clearing something, clear energy blocks. You're activating your higher chakras. And this is why you are successful. Okay. You could be gaining new friends. Okay to help you shift your perception okay because i feel like you you feel like you're doing something alone but it's other people that are going through the same thing so spirit wants you to know just let it go let it flow okay yeah oneself blossoming you're blossoming okay you're growing even if you don't feel like something is growing it's growing okay you just have to release this karmic relationship, okay? Because this person really doubts love. This person doesn't believe in love. This person believes in hurting, okay? I'm hearing hurt people hurt people. So, you just got to take shit for what it is and look at everything like a lesson at this point, okay? Who said that? Glow. Gorilla. <laughs> okay, some of y'all could be listening to Big Glow. Okay, yeah, so if you guys are feeling a little sad, Spurs says switch up switch up the tempo. Listen to some music. Get in the energy of you know. I'm F R E E fuck nigga free. <laughs> I me, mean, I ain't gotta worry about no fuck nigga G. Okay, I don't know who I'm talking to, but whoever you are, you just gotta understand, babe, you know you fine, don't you, babe? You know you fine. <laughs> okay, so you gotta understand who you are. Fuck what anybody else is saying or thinking, you know. Spirit wants you just take the time for yourself. Cause yeah, consciously, you're being empowered. Okay, because you're free. You're free from this karmic relationship. 
-hmm. Okay, you're free from unhappiness. Consciously, you know. Yeah, we have aligning with infinity abundance. So, you guys are aligned, okay? 10, 10, you guys are being called to enter the vortex. But somebody is not aligned with your abundance, okay? To be able to come into union with you. They're not. They just want something to not end. Somebody's like, it's not over until they say it is. Like I said, they feel like that this is a marathon. So what's the marathon going on? Why is this energy? What's going on? Yeah, guilt. I release any beliefs that no longer assist with my soul's growth. Somebody's going to have to let this go. <laughs> They're just going to have to let it go because you're not going to fight with somebody. Yeah, delight. Things are light for you, okay? Things are very light for you and your energy. Even if you guys could be going through some things, you still feel some type of intense joy. Somebody just doesn't like that, okay? They don't like the fact that you have this joy, this delight about your life, okay? You're invoking some type of light in others, and you actually accept yourself. I am learning that to accept things I cannot change. You accept the things that you can't change. This is why you are abundant and you're persevering. So like I said, if things have been stagnant, okay, there's a miracle coming through. Because you actually change and you're allowed to change, okay? Somebody wants you to feel like you can't change, okay? Because you couldn't see them. You couldn't see what they was doing in your energy. Because, yeah, this person is grieving now. Yeah, perception and conscious. Somebody failed at trying to change your perception in something, okay? Because consciously you were aware of your reality and whatever they was throwing at you and sending to you. Yeah, yeah. Higher consciousness, awareness, in reverse. This person does not have no type of awareness. This person is not trying to heal. Okay? Yeah. yeah. Meanwhile, you have a relationship here with spirit. With God. Okay? God is your partner. I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. And you're being called to trust your relationship. With the universe reminds us that the connected to one another just as we are connected to the great mother the universe that birthed us all so you're being called to trust the universe that the universe will provide for you that you know you don't need this person yeah free you're being called to understand you are free there's something about balance health yeah there's something about you being very disciplined and you're very balanced you focus on your health this is this is a part of your purpose so your purpose literally flows from within. So if something is not flowing, I feel like spirit wants you to know it is because some something or someone is in your energy that is not a part of your purpose. Okay, because somebody fears your confidence. They don't like the fact that you have gifts, that you are gifted. They don't like it. Mm -mm. They don't like the fact that, you know, you're being called to take risks. Now, this person is trying to stop you from taking a risk as well. This person doesn't want you to take any risk. Because I feel like this person actually needs your energy to feel celebrated. Like, somebody wants you to celebrate them. Because they see you are going through a renewal. They see you are going through a rebirth. So, they figure they can just jump on the bandwagon. Yeah, the chariot. Feels like you know whatever you say is it goes for them. So they feel like they're you protected. They're protected. But I feel like this new beginning isn't for this person. This new beginning is just for you. It wasn't to bring this karmic along with you. Okay, give me some more energy for this. What's going on for my collector? My collective. That's too many cards. Let's do one card. Death and reverse. I, what did I just say, y'all? It's a marathon. Like, somebody wants a marathon to happen here because they see that you get love. Okay? The will of fortune. You invest in Queen of Swords. So, you told somebody that, you know, you wanted to end something. And somebody's like, it's not over. Somebody is like, it's not over. Hey, Wands, I'm telling the truth. Somebody is like, no, it's not over. They don't, they won't, 
they will not stop until they stop you healing yourself. Okay, somebody's like, it's not over till I can stop you from healing yourself. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles with the Hurt Front, with the Chariot, with the Seven of Swords. Okay. This person has been doing a lot of work behind the scenes when it comes to your spiritual growth, okay? I feel like this is multiple people, okay, that are doing work behind the scenes. But I feel like you're protected from anybody that comes in your energy that, are, that, that wants to put some swords in your back. Yeah, the, the tower with the knight of wands because these people are trying to come in fast because, like I said, you are trying to end something here. You're trying to heal and you're trying to move on. But it's like these people are being warned and even with them being warned, like, hey, you're protected with the chariot and the seven of swords. It's like we don't give a fuck. We're going to come in. We're going to stab this. You stab this person in their back again. We're going to make this person feel, you know, more hurt. So somebody just is focused on hurting. Like, yeah, this is a lot of hurt people. This is what I just heard. So a lot of hurt people in your energy. Nine of Wands. Page of Cups with the food. With the Three of Pentacles. So you guys are being called to take some type of adventure, to, to move forward when it comes to your spiritual growth. Okay, with the hair font, with the food under the hair font, that's what it's giving me. With the page of cups, it's giving me a very childish energy. Somebody could want to communicate something to you, but they only want to communicate to you so they can try to do something to make you feel bad and sad about the past. With the three of pentacles here, I feel like these people that collaborated to, together are going through tower moments. Okay, why is the three of pentacles here? Three of pentacles. Yeah, Ace of Swords in reverse. So somebody is actually blocked. Somebody wanted to block a new beginning, Queen of Pentacles, but they see that you are still abundant. We have the Seven of Cups with the Lovers and the Wheel of Fortune. There's a lot of illusions. There's a lot of people competing with um, your stability. Seven of Pentacles, seven, seven, seven again. That's what I'm getting. So these people are being warned multiple times. Like, I'm so tired of this, y'all. These people are being warned to leave this shit alone because they're going to be left out in, in the cold. They're going to be in deep regret. I can't make this up. I'm getting tired of this energy. Five of Wands. It's a lot of conflict. Okay. It's a lot of conflict behind the scenes here when it comes to you making the decision, Queen of Cups, to be nurturing, current, and loving, and healing yourself, okay? Eight of pen, I mean, Eight of Cups. I'm sorry, you guys. Eight of Cups. So you walked away from a situation. Ooh, we, the moon. It's a lot going on behind the scenes, and I feel like you know it, okay? You know that these people are invested in ending you. You know they are invested in illusions. You know this, you know? This is why you're being called to shift your perception, Okay? And to see beyond an illusion. Because something is not fulfilling to someone else. This is why somebody has been doing all this slandering and competing with you. Because they want you to stop. Yeah. And soon stop again. They want you to stop. But you're not stopping. Yeah. The devil. Okay. Somebody feels like you the devil, but in our reality, this person is the devil. They want you, they want to force you to accept an offer. They don't want something to end. It's a marathon, and it's multiple people behind the scenes doing this. I can't make this shit up. The devil with the Knight of Pentacles. They want to stop an offer, and it's multiple people behind the scenes doing this shit, y'all. I can't make this up. All the devil is using all these people, okay? Whatever entities they <laughs> the devil's using all these people because all these illusions are somebody want to cause major confusion to an emperor and an author but I feel like it's not working I keep I've been picking up on this energy it's all about an offer meanwhile you're healing somewhere healing not even worried about an emperor I don't even know why I'm picking up on um Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. So, yeah, this is somebody from the past that wanted to keep you, like, up, keep you put up somewhere. <laughs> and, like, 
there's really somebody that is coming to rescue you. And they don't want this. This person from the past, okay, they don't want you to receive justice when it comes to passion, love. Because they know you've been doing a lot of healing work. And this is causing a tower moment for somebody that they're not getting what they wished. They are stressed out because they feel like they're going to be left out in the cold because they know they've been doing behind the scenes. Also, somebody deals with a lot of women that are not on your level. So that's another reason why they don't want this marathon to end. Because it's like, you know, I'm, I'm, this person has a lot of play of ways, okay? They, but something just don't hit like you. Okay, something just don't hit like you. Yeah, six of wands because you are the star. You are the one that are, you are the one that, you know, is self-sufficient, independent. Okay, you're very focused her. And this makes somebody very burdened and stressed out that you are still in a ten of Okay, this is why this card fell out because I feel like there's a lot of competition behind the offer. I admit that I was a bitch only because I envied you. So somebody is admitting this, okay? These people have no reason to not like you because you're in your power. You're very nurturing, current, and loving, and you want to walk away and somebody's mad. So I don't know why somebody wants you to argue and compete. You're not in regret, okay? You're not in regret about someone because you're still, you know, moving forward. You're still healing. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles still came up upright. So you're still, things are still solid, okay? King of Swords, you had to step into a King of Swords energy. So you had to really cut some shit off. You must have said some harsh words to this person, okay? And I feel like this person is not liking the fact that they have to sell the comma water. Somebody's being guided away from you, okay? Somebody's definitely being guided away from you to leave you alone. Because I'm hearing your ancestors say you done put in too much work to just let this person bring you back to that state of mind. Yeah, Knight of Wands. Something is coming in regardless. This person is very flighty, like I said. They deal with a lot of women. Yeah, but something's coming in, you guys. And it is going to bring so much stability here with the Four of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles. This is a brand new beginning. Five of Swords, Seven of Pentacles, and the Ace of Cups. Somebody just feels very defeated when it comes to your investments, when it comes to, you know, love and what you are investing in. Somebody just feels like, you know, you don't deserve it, but you do. You put up with this person's bullshit, so you deserve to be free and you deserve to move forward. Yeah, two of wands. You deserve to leave this devil because this person was the devil. Literally, this person did magic on you. They slandered you because you was healing all because you was healing. All because you wanted to heal. All because you were confident, okay? And you didn't want to be in an illusion. You wanted to lift the veil. You wanted to see beyond the illusion, okay? And I'm getting some people with a... These, oh wait, the love was in reverse. I can't make this up. You released this lover because what I was about to say is, what I'm getting is, you guys, some, somebody felt like, oh, well... I could be doing this for somebody else. You're like, go do it, okay? Because whatever this person failed to realize is that you and their your energy and their energy don't mix. So you could have been tied around this person, feeling really burdened around this person. It's because you your your spirit guys. They was like, you know, it's time to go. You got to release this level. It's time to be free. You don't have to be in this energy. Yeah, six of pentacles. What did I say? It's all because this person could have money or something. They could guilt to other women and these women they don't care page of pentacles in reverse they don't care okay they don't care about not being fulfilled okay in whatever area it is okay this person these people these women don't even fulfill this this masculine or this feminine whoever you are take what resonates you guys but that this person is not being fulfilled regardless okay and it's literally because this person is just you know doing something for all the wrong reasons okay somebody could even be given to other women to make you mad but like i said it's not making you mad it's not making you in regret because you see beyond the illusions you know this person ain't happy this person won't leave you alone <laughs> this person won't leave you alone literally yeah four of pentacles this person is trying to hold you tight hold me close and work me slowly work it work it Cause I'm the type of girl, need a type of guy that can last. Ooh, work it, work it. Don't need no one around if he's going down too fast. 
what you got a what me slowly see you guys this person don't even know how to work it's wine with this page of wines this person's childish okay and i'm here yeah they probably ain't even you know got enough packing lacking down there okay this is why they try to hold you close because they know these other lovers they ain't even fulfill fulfilling this person they just chained to this person okay this person uses these people okay it's ego okay ego they feed their ego they feed them okay what they need but you are seeing beyond these illusions with the moon and the will of fortune and the judgment oh what did i say you know you got some type of judgment coming through when it comes to some type of divine partner some type of communications coming in but like i said that song you guys, you know, you the type of girl, you need the type of guy that can last. <laughs> you like, nah, I need somebody to work it, work it. Give me one more. <laughs> yeah, strength in reverse. This person is not strong enough to go with you, period. And that's what I'm getting. This person's not strong enough mentally, physically, okay? This person can't even pull away from their addictions and they from offers. Like, this person, somebody offer that, they, they going, I can't make this up. Seven of Cups. Somebody offer them something, they going. Meanwhile, you sit back in the King of Swords energy. Five of Pentacles, you letting things go. Okay? You're, you're, you're letting things be illuminated. You're seeing beyond the illusion, sir. Somebody else, they can't do that shit. Yeah, temperance. They can't do that shit. This person wanted you to juggle, but you're not. Like I said, you're making a decision, and that's what they didn't want you to do. Five of Cups. They didn't want you to make a decision because now they're heartbroken because the magic that they work is bringing burdens. Like, these women are burdens. So, they're not women. They're like kids. Like, that's what I'm getting. They're like kids. This person could mess with younger children, but younger children. So, this person could be like... See, that's what I'm talking about. This, these people fuck with divine beings and divine feminine and masculines and then be fucking with kids. Like... Of course, you're not going to ever get over the divine film if you're fucking with people that are not even on your vibration. This person isn't even on your vibration. This person has a lot of lessons to learn, okay? This person, could, somebody could be messing with somebody that even lied about the age. I can't make this up. Ten of Wands. These women are nothing but burdens. These, these childish women, okay? Because they are admitting that they only envied you because, okay? They was a bitch. And a real divine film is not putting their stuff in this category because you wouldn't envy other people if you're focused on your own healing process, right? Nine of swords in reverse. You're not in regret. You're not crying. You're not losing sleep over this person. Okay? And this person is in regret because you ended up a cycle. Yeah. I can't make this up. The Empress in reverse and the Emperor in reverse? <sighs> this could even be a couple. So what I'm getting is, it's a couple people that wanted to stress you out. So these people could be harassing you too. So somebody could be harassing you. This Empress in reverse, she stressed out, she... They did a lot of magic behind the scenes, okay, when it comes to illusions. Somebody could sleep around, okay? Somebody could definitely be having threesomes and stuff. But like I said, something is just not satisfying, okay, to nobody hers. Nobody's satisfied, okay? And, and all of these women and this man is narcissist, okay? <laughs> Clarify the Empress and the Emperor in reverse. It's just crazy how they came out like that. But we have Nine of Swords in reverse with the Empress and the Emperor. So these people did all of this. And they are the ones, they are stuck together. They are meant to be together. So this could be somebody's child's mother, child's father, okay? Maybe you was dealing with somebody like this, okay? But these people are meant to be together because they both narcissists. They both deal with people for the wrong things. They don't want real love. They just want to look like, you know, they want to look protected. <laughs> they want to look like, yeah, Ten of Cups. I'm telling you, they just want to look. Like they are in this Ten of Cups, but you are truly the one that are in this Ten of Cups. With the Five of Swords and the Four of Cups, this person is like in deep regret because something did not work. Clarify the Ten of Cups. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. Somebody's definitely invested in something here. Eight of Wands. Two of Cups. 
well, I don't know what these people got going on, but these people expected them teaming up together to run a marathon. Y'all, I ain't even gonna tell y'all what I just heard. Okay, so what I just heard was, it's motherfuckers, these are kids, man. Somebody is like, what the? Somebody wants to, it's Freaky Friday, okay? It's Freaky Friday, y'all. I ain't had a Freaky Friday in a long time, but I, if y'all want me to get Freaky Friday in my rings, I get Freaky Friday. But somebody thought that they was going to have a dick sucking marathon, okay? Somebody was like, I don't know, I bet you I can do it better than that. This uh, this emperor is really fucked up because he know that don't nobody do nothing like you do it better than you are nothing right. These people are narcissists, okay, as fuck. But we have the King of Cups and the Ace of Cups here with the, with the Knight of Cups. I need to go grow up with y'all, man, because y'all already know you the goat, okay. I don't give a fuck about none of that, okay. When it comes to this confusion, illusions, you already know you the goat. So there is somebody coming in. Okay, that knows your worth. Yeah, tower. And it's going to cause a tower moment. Because this person is a king of pentacles. This person is stable, very mature. Okay. And judgment is being called. Because something is just not... Somebody's just not happy. Somebody's just not fulfilled. Yeah, the high priest. Queen of swords. You blocking somebody. It got somebody in their head. Like... These narcissists are mad, okay? Women can be narcissists too, y'all. We have the four swords in reverse with the six of swords. So you being guided away. Meanwhile, somebody can't rest. They can't sleep. This queen of wands is being left out in the cold. She's being exposed. All her secrets is coming out. Yeah, three of cups that they, I'm telling y'all, they like to overindulge third parties. Okay, I'm here, heard it all before, but your lies ain't working now, look who's hurting now, I had to shut you down, I had to shut you down, okay, so you gotta shut this person down, but you are about to receive some type of supernatural healing, that's what I just heard, with the star court and the knight of swords, somebody's about to come in and all of this shit, it's gonna feel like it never happened. Yeah, if I was sort of reverse, and I hate to say it like that, but these people deserve each other. Okay, you didn't never deserve this to be unhappy. This is why judgment is being called. You're gonna get somebody that is going to literally um be there for you spiritually, physically, emotionally. It's gonna be a balance. Yeah. And somebody is watching. They are watching to see if something has happened. Somebody also is stalking you. Okay? They want to communicate something to you. Because somebody is mad that they couldn't end you. Okay? I feel like that was the goal. The goal was to end you. So, the goal is not really to be a happy family. Or to be um, happy or whatever. The goal is for you not to be happy. For you not to be happy. So, these people did all of this, Knight of Cups, and you are still walking away. You're still leaving somebody. This is keeping somebody trapped in their head because they expected you to need them. Seven of Wands, you're blocking this person. And Queen of Swords, you, you are standing firm on what you say. Yeah, because the Holy Spirit cleared out this confusion for you and let you know you are walking right into your destiny. So, this person want to hold you back from a whole destiny. These, this woman... This couple, whoever this is. Yeah. Five of Cups, Queen of Wands. They are deep regret because you're still confident. You're still moving forward fearlessly. Okay. The judgment is for these people to be unhappy, not you. That's what has been illuminated in your energy. These people are being left out in the cold when it comes to this confusion. Ace of Swords. Ace of Wands. Okay. So you have clarity around your will of fortune, around your destiny. So you have clarity when it comes to your destiny. I can't make this up. You have a lot of clarity. Yeah, King of Pentacles. Somebody is definitely coming in. And they're going to put you in a new vibration. They're going to help you elevate the moon in reverse. You see beyond the illusions. And you're not hurt. Because somebody really wanted you to be hurt. They didn't expect you to come out of all of the slander and lies they were saying. They didn't expect you to come out of it, okay? So 
So if you have been feeling like, you know, things weren't flowing at first, it was because these people was behind the scenes doing a lot of slandering, talking about you, talking about you to make themselves feel better. Uh, I hate when people do that. Like, people be whole in relationships and keep bringing somebody up. Like, this person, this masculine or this feminine, somebody brings you up every day. And this is another reason why this masculine attacked you with this feminine. Because he's like, this feminine, this masculine does not even want this person. And you're still attacking this person. For what? When you didn't even want this person, you were trying to heal. This person was trying to hurt you. So this woman was like, okay, we hurt it together. Because I don't want her to be happy neither. Word shit. Yeah, two little witches, magical space quarantine. Mend a broken heart, fairy, healing from heartache. I can't make this up. They didn't want you to heal from a heartache. Like this person had not already put you through enough bullshit. Like, really? Guidance. But where will it lead you? Somebody wanted you to feel shifted, bored, and stuck. But this person said, count your blessings. Please don't lose hope, okay? Because a powerful energy shift is coming, and it is time for you to have a treat, baby. Yeah, voodoo in the blue. Back off. A time for spur. A whole lot of healing. So they think you're going to be mad the whole time. Like I said, people be trying to do your bad. God, do your better. All right? <laughs> Middle fairy cleanup time. Yes, yeah, cleanup time. So, yeah, we have 36 could be significant. 315 could be significant. It's definitely cleaning time. Somebody thought they thought they was gonna get away with this shit collective. They ain't getting a little away with shit. We're gonna pull from a situation deck. Ooh, Kipper. First said it's, it's okay for you to heal. So you you don't have to start your healing process over because you already went through. You already went through the test. You already passed the test. You you spoke up, told this person the truth. You didn't keep this person in illusions. Now you're about to get your great fortune. I'm telling you guys, it's time for a treat. You need to expect something here. Okay, expect something here. When it comes to this mature man, so there's a mature man that might be coming in with some great fortune. Here. Like I said, you got somebody that's coming in that's going to put you where you need to be, baby. And somebody else is going to be in deep despair. When this comes in, yeah, because somebody's going to take a pathway. Somebody's going to take a path, pathway and transform with you. You and this person could even have a kid together. That's held in high honor. Wealthy man in reverse. This emperor in reverse, this man is losing money. This man is losing money here. Somebody wanted something to end for you because they wanted to steal something. Somebody wanted you to be in poverty as well. So I feel like these women did this voodoo, did all this work. This man did all this manipulation talking about you because they wanted you to fall off. Okay? They wanted you to fall off, but you're still getting some type of income. Unexpected income. Great fortune was the first thing that came out. So you're, nothing's falling for you because these people are out of your energy now, huh? Yeah, somebody's getting a message of concern that you have an official person here. And you're receiving some type of sudden wealth. Somebody was a false person at a distance. Yeah, at a distance. I can't make this up. Distant horizon. At a distance, you you could need to travel. Okay, your answer said if you travel, you could receive some type of great fortune here. Because I feel like that's a community that wanted you to be in jail and in poverty. This mature woman. Like I said, they wanted you to be unhappy. They wanted something to be not fulfilling for you. They didn't want you to heal. Yeah, a false person, adjudication. Somebody could be 30, 38. But yeah, it's definitely a false person. These people definitely work together. Somebody's getting a message about you loving what you do for work. And that's why you got such well. Yeah, but somebody expected something. <laughs> They're not getting it. They're not getting it. So any thoughts that they had to, to change this privileged lady's outcome when it comes to court? This could even be people in your family. It's it's not happening the way they wanted it to. Yeah, journey. You're still taking some type of journey here. 
and you still love what you do for work. Yeah, toil and labor. Something is just not working. Somebody's gonna <sighs> working very hard all day life. All my life. They couldn't break me. They couldn't break me. <laughs> okay, we have total labor and imprisonment. Somebody could even go to jail. Yeah, this definitely this lover could definitely be going to jail for doing all this work on you to stop you from your journey because you actually changed. I can't make this up. You could be being called to change your occupation or you just did change your occupation. Yeah, you could be getting a message of concern her. Somebody was sending you thoughts her. Somebody was sending you negative thoughts. Okay, this person was not held in high honor. Now somebody's concerned in this family room about you getting married. What? We have a mature man and gift in reverse. So somebody thought they was going to get some type of gift from somebody. They're not getting it. Okay? Somebody's not getting this gift. Why is gift in reverse? Child in reverse. So did somebody thought they was going to use a child to get some type of income from you? <laughs> Somebody thought they was going to use a child to get some type of income. They're not getting shit. Yeah, privileged lady. Just because you're privileged, they thought they were. No. These other women, this person that you was dealing with, they dealt with other women. And they thought that Empress in Reverse uh, could have got the same thing that uh, Queen of Cups and uh, Queen of Wands in Upright gets. You can't. This empress in reverse is not an empress. She's in reverse. <laughs> She's not no good to a real divine being, this empress in reverse. She's not no good. There's nothing that she could do that would be better than the Queen of Cups. Because the Queen of Cups got a lot of love. Okay? She got all this love around her. Somebody knows they worth and they're confident. And they're, they feel good about themselves. They sexy. They mature. Like, what is this masculine thinking? Give me more for this energy. Yeah, you're winning. Success. Somebody wanted to trap you with a child. It didn't work. To receive some type of gift. It didn't work. They thought using a child was going to cause you conflict. That didn't work. Somebody, this person is arguing with this empress in reverse, okay? They're going through natural disasters because somebody really did do too much in your energy. Yeah, you withdrew from these people. You're rejecting these people because you know they weren't mad. Somebody just wanted, they wanted your luck, okay? They are sick because they know they are cursed. They're getting evidence that they're cursed. They're getting, they're getting this evidence. Yeah, fate in reverse. It wasn't fated for them to win. This, Like I said, this person wanted to give somebody your spot. But they didn't want to leave you alone because they knew this person didn't even amount to you. Now somebody wants to compromise because they are so mad that they did this. Like Somebody's even more mad that you are actually taking the steps to heal yourself and you are not going for this marathon. Yeah, homeless. Somebody feels like a failure. Somebody is mad as fuck that you're getting justice and you're ready. They want you to stop. They want something to happen to you. But no, it's their loss, not yours. You're not losing out on anything. You're not the one that are protesting against these, against these people. You're not the one that are trying to make somebody not heal. Okay? You're not trying to stop nobody's healing process. Somebody's trying to stop your healing process. Like, yeah, murder. These people, they don't even got no, they don't believe in nothing. So, of course, they wanted to stop you. They wanted to dominate you. They wanted you to worry. They wanted you to be disturbed like them. These people are freaking energy vampires. I'm getting sucky best energies. Yeah, compromise. You don't want to deal with no third parties. You're not reconciling with this person. This person wants to apologize because it was all in their mind. They knew these, these, this empress in reverse didn't amount to you. Worry in reverse. You're not worried. You're not worried. These people are worried that you're going to get what you want. And you are. Merge. Eternal love. This person can't trap you because you care. Somebody also feels like this collaboration was for no reason. 
Yeah, because you're not disturbed. Because they did this all to disturb you. It it was to look and seem as if they are happy. So somebody could have did something for somebody, like I said, to make it seem like they are happy. They're not happy. Okay? Somebody just... Have you ever heard the same... Um, somebody just didn't want you to be happy. Okay? People are holding on to you because they don't want somebody else to be happy. Yeah, wish in reverse. Somebody didn't get their wish when it comes to this ritual. Because you do a lot of self-care rituals and you're relaxed. So, meanwhile, somebody trying to do a ritual on you and they sit up and talk about you, whatever they did, collect them. You're getting justice because you're living and learning. Yeah, this person was tempted by the devil. Okay, somebody thought that something looked better and they still wanted to be in your energy. The devil gave them what they want. Now they're stuck with it. Like I said, these people, are, these narcissists are meant for each other here. Yeah, and then they want to apologize because they feel guilty because you love yourself. I can't make this up. You want more? Yeah, and you're coaching these people how to be obedient. Okay, somebody realizes that they was in an illusion. Yeah, because they, they start to think about some memories. Now they're mad as fuck because you're getting everything that you plan to get. You're organized. You, okay, and they are mad. Okay, I'm here in March Madness. So somebody could be mad next month. Okay, because a lot of shit's about to start happening for you next month. Okay, I just heard. So March Madness, somebody's going to be mad as fuck. Yeah, sweet dreams because you're having sweet dreams. And you're going to get some type of promise or somebody wants to. You get some type of confirmation. Like I said, you're getting something. Something's coming and these people know they was expecting what you was getting. But it was all in their mind. It was all in their mind. Yeah, accident in reverse. You are not injured. Somebody wanted you to be injured in danger. You're not injured. Somebody also wanted to hurt you, I just heard. So somebody could have wanted to hurt you. You could have been getting harassed. People were saying they was going to do something. It's just because these people are mad. They're not going to do shit. They all talk no bite. Because somebody took a risk and they are struggling because they use their savings to do something. And they stressed out because you're getting good news. You're a sweetheart and if something is over. Yeah, gain. You're still gaining. Yeah, you're still getting blessings. You're still able to take a venture. You're still reaching your goals. You're not binded to nothing. Yeah, nightmare in reverse. You're not having nightmares. Somebody wanted to bully you because you had good ideas. Okay? Somebody don't like that. They don't like the way you think. They don't like the fact that you are healing yourself and they need your help. Somebody needs your help because they see you know your worth. This enemy sees you're persevering. They're scared. They want you to stop being so relaxed. Okay? Because you're ready. Somebody really thought that what they did was going to make you sick. So like I said, somebody did something for somebody else or something. You don't give a fuck. Yeah, stubbornness. You didn't give a fuck. You didn't even want to hurt it. So it was like this person made themselves even more mad because that just put you in the energy of being ready to take off and leave this person. Like, okay, I'm really not worried about this. So somebody's sick because you pray. Yeah, you're reaching your goals. You're ready. You're reaching your goals. Okay. Why is alliances here? Yeah, you pray. You have alliances here. You have alliances that are helping you reach your goals. Yeah, you're saving. And somebody's sick about this. Yeah, because they try to they use their savings to try to dominate you. So they definitely did some type of work or all because of some type of love offer. Yeah, or some type of investment that you had when it comes to wealth. Yeah, eternal love and invest investments. These people collaborate to try to trap you, but they're getting good news. They see you're getting good news because you're a sweetheart and something's over. <sighs> so leave these people where they at, collect them. Okay? Because something's over. I feel like this karmic got something to say, so I'm going to pull one from this karmic girl today. Okay. What does this karmic woman want to say to my collective? I have him on a tight leash because he misbehaves. I'm telling you. Somebody thought that something was going to upset you and it's not. So this person could, like I said, if this person has kids with somebody, they could be using this person. 
Okay, your divine masculine is a good liar. I don't even believe half the shit he says. But you already know this, divine fam. I have a feeling we won't last. <laughs> you already know this too. This is why you are not putting in the fight. Yeah. Okay, I just said this on last read. I don't know if it's going to post, which is going to post first. But believe me, you don't want him right now. You already know. So whoever you are, you already know these things. He's still a player, so it's playing you, me, and you, me, you, and somebody else too. We already know. That's why you let this person go. <laughs> That's just the awareness part, right? You guys are already aware. So Spirit wants you to focus on your healing. Okay? Basically, this message is for you to continue to focus on your healing. Yeah, friendship. Like I said, you could be getting new friends. Somebody's coming in to help you. Okay, help you with your path, help you on the next steps to take her. Yeah, personal alchemy. To go through another transformation to get justice and receive some type of growth. You're being called to explore. Explore your options, explore the world. Okay, don't stay stuck. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. <laughs> okay, give me one of these cards. Then I'm going to get an ancestor's message. Give me one card. Yeah, infinite abundance. You're fully supported as you're devoted to yourself to your divine life purpose. See, is what I'm saying. Your life purpose centers around something to do with children. Your life purpose involves helping, teaching, and healing children. See, you guys are not, you're very unfazed. And you are definitely being called to heal. Heal your inner child. Okay, this person does not align with your mission because this person doesn't even want to heal their inner child so a lot of things you can look at you can have the perception of a child okay because these are the wounds that you are healing like this is what keeps you in a high vibration because you are like relearning things when it comes to how you was programmed how you was raised so it's okay that's what i just heard it's okay you're gonna be okay things are gonna start flowing just continue to move forward and let this person go. Because you are a leader here. Yeah, move in a new direction. I can't make this up. So your ancestors want you to travel and move in a new direction. White witch, be the light. I'm telling you, these people was intimidated by you. Because you see from a higher perspective here. Let go of the need to be right. You let go of the need to be right. You're like, you know what, this person don't want to heal. I'm not going to sit here with you and... You know, yeah, you're a wise one. Grow within your current situation. Your ancestors want you to grow within the current situation here. Because, see, your seeds are growing. You just have to set your sights higher. Because, like I said, your mission, your purpose is so much bigger than you. Okay? You guys are going to be helping people. Yeah, you're a great teacher. Learn from your spiritual experiences. Release the old and reset. Okay? Your ancestors want you to release the old, reset. Okay, reset, recharge as many times as you want to, but do not, I repeat, do not continue to go backwards. Do not continue to repeat the same cycles with this person because this person is going to cause more damage to your healing. And I'm not saying, you know, you're perfect, but this person definitely feels like, you know, whatever you do, you're perfect using kids. Like I said, this person definitely could be using kids in a situation that definitely could be cult energy. You need more for this energy. Yeah, I don't know if y'all see it, but my screen just got really blurry over. Okay. I don't know. Some of y'all, yeah, y'all ancestors is definitely in the, in the building, okay? Your mind is focused on the level up. They want you to know you're protected, okay, and guarded. God said it was all a test. Trust the process and don't give up. I can't make this up. You was being tested, okay? People was envying you because of this masculine, right? But you're getting new loving family and friends because you're changing your ways. So you really don't even have nothing to be worried about. Just continue to heal yourself and work on yourself. Yeah, and don't trust it. Don't trust this person. Dropping this karmic helped me figure out who I am as a person. Somebody lied. Okay, so you guys, somebody lied. And <laughs> you already know this. This is why, yeah, you already know. You already knew it was fish. Somebody lied. Act like they quit talking to somebody. They quit dealing with somebody. They was dealing with this person the whole time, okay? <laughs> Even if it wasn't like that. This person was definitely getting what they want for, you know, what they got. Give them what they want, you know. Little pad, little, little. 
little strange for a piece of change. And this could even be their kid's mother or kid's father. But, yeah. Good luck with that. Yeah, but you are a star, her. Yeah, somebody wanted to manipulate your energy because you was too much for them. Because you in your soft girl aura. Yeah, and you got an army strong behind you. And I know y'all see that shit. My whole screen ain't blurry no more. It was just blurry as fuck. Yeah, this person said let go because these people curse themselves, her. And they hate you. Somebody's mad because they blocked from your blessings. <sighs> Somebody tried to say you wasn't a good role model or something, but you are. Yeah, doesn't believe in you. Shit don't add up. Ain't no way, okay? Somebody wanted to use your energy to benefit. Benefit wealth, abundance. These people knew, okay? Your worth makes you more attractive. Set me free. Take a risk. I'm telling you. Somebody took a lot of risk coming towards you. Loser. Life path number three. Killer. Confidence. Somebody is a confidence killer. Okay? This person is the type of person that will kill somebody else's confidence because they don't have it. Okay? Yeah, somebody's going through an ego death because you broke up with them. I'm telling you. Because it's something about this person that just was not for you. And it's okay. Like, it's not like this person is a bad person. It's just like you're facing the fact that, you know, this person is not for you anymore. Okay? And somebody's mad. Because it's giving me one of the energies. Like, if they could have did you how they wanted to do you before you left them alone, it would have been okay. But since they couldn't, it's not okay for you to leave. It's not okay for you to drop your hair down, Rapunzel. Yeah, because you're from another planet. But this was definitely a past life lesson. Okay? Because somebody was definitely was dealing with gold diggers. Trying to find ways to trap you. But you're making healthy choices, so it didn't work. Anything else for it? Yeah, you're a chosen one. This person was trying to access your accounts and not learning the lesson, so they don't want to. Yeah, this person's like, I ain't learning no lesson. I don't want to. Okay. I got secrets. I'm telling you because this person got secrets. But you have a divine masculine here that's coming in. This person don't got addictions. This person, yeah. Somebody feels left behind. This could be fake friends. They think you could be giving up on love, okay? But beware of fake vibes because you're moving on here. These people definitely are teamwork and behind the scenes. Your dreams could have told you something. So pay attention because you're a helper here. And these people are getting nothing but bad karma. You help these people in a time of need. Acting very childish because they don't want you to be a better person. That is so weird to me. Court issues due to child support. He or she mad. I don't want her. Okay. First said, continue to be kind because God is the best. Vibrate higher. Yeah, the cops is involved in this situation too. So somebody better be very careful. Okay. Very careful. Baby mama, baby daddy. Somebody needs to be very careful. So somebody could be being you know, watched under surveillance here. If you focus on your own journey, it will lead you to happiness from within. Don't lose focus. See, Spur said, if this person would have been focused on their own shit, they wouldn't even be being watched. But somebody is being definitely being watched by the cops. And they definitely need to watch that shit. They need to watch out, okay? And quit fucking with you. Yeah, somebody going to be asking you for help. Help me out this mess. Anything else? Yeah, this person's ducking action. Black cat. I'm telling you, your ancestors ain't playing, baby. Teamed up with your enemies. It's like I'm lying. These motherfuckers did the most in your energy. And then they thought that was going to come back and stick and stab and jab you and, and leave you down on hook you know leave you leave you for dead no your your goons your spur team is like uh-uh now 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 that these people are out of your energy we're gonna show you how protected you really are baby okay not my baby that's what your ancestors said not my baby because you literally are a, a, a role model there's something that you are doing you're supposed to be teaching people so it's part of your purpose these relationships are part of your purpose, okay, for you to release, for you to learn. Yeah, we have honesty is the best policy. I am supported on my path. My light attracts light. Truth is my teacher. Yeah, you're a truth speaker, a truth teacher. Where there's a will, there's a way. God's always going to make a way for y'all, baby. I don't care what you say. What they say, okay, God's always going to make for you. He's always going to spend a block for you because you do right by people. Okay, this person tried to make you out to be a bad person because you didn't want to be with them and you didn't want to hurt with them and hurt with everybody else they was hurting with and what they was dealing with. Fuck that shit. Give me one more. 
We have 44. Your angels are encouraging you to continue on your present life path with diligence and determination. Even greater success will come in the future. I am supported. So you are supported. We have zero. There is no beginning and no end. All is infinite. It is time to develop your spiritual side. You are gaining new sight and understanding both godly and earthly things. I am limitless. So yeah, you guys, you are understanding your spiritual journey a little more deeper and a little more in depth. Ooh, we, we've been on here for a whole hour, okay? But yeah, you are experiencing something a little more deeper, okay? Because believing is seeing, believing is seeing, and living with purpose brings you prosperity. So this is why these people had to be terminated out your energy. I was saying this a couple days ago. These people had to go, okay? That's all I got for y'all. Love and light. Namaste. I'll show you.